Bringing the people behind our food to life. Commercial composting is as easy as taking the garbage out. When you're in the food industry, you know you have more of a sense of what food is about, where it comes from and where it goes. And you know, you, you can see every day in your kitchen, you have barrels full of lettuces and carrot peelings and onion peelings that are all just going into the garbage. We have a tremendous amount of waste in a restaurant situation. You can't help it. There's just It just happens. So why not use it? Why not make it into something that's valuable instead of taking it to a landfill that are getting bigger and bigger and bigger and taking up more and more space? It doesn't, it doesn't make sense. There you go. Well, I don't know, 15 or so years ago, we had a, um, a portable composter on the, on the porch out front. We tried that for about a year and it was really uh, um, not very successful because it was kind of dirty, lots of flies, you know, we, and people would comment, you know, oh, it's kind of smelly out here. We really wanted to try it, but there was no one around in Portland who was willing, no garbage collectors who were willing to really take, a, take that on as a, as a way of helping the city, you know, helping people to take care of the ways to make, make it into something. And muffin or toast for you. Portland is a very um, progressive city. We were approached by the Metro Council people. So they came to us and they said, okay, here's the program. We'll provide you with the cans. We'll provide you with the, you know, we'll set you up with a service. We'll do all the footwork for you and get it you organized. You just have to do it. It's not a complex program. So we simply segregate as we're throwing things away during the, during the day. We segregate out plastic, glass, and metal. And the rest of it goes into one barrel or several barrel, barrels as we have it in our situation. And we would have that, those barrels at the end of the day anyway. So then the cook simply takes it out to the garbage can, dumps it in the waste, the, the, the composting bin, puts the recycling in the recycling bins, and then it's all over. It's not any, really any different than taking out the garbage. You know, we're not taking it to the landfill. We're not taking it to the recycler. Someone's just coming just like they would under ordinary circumstances. They're picking it up. We're just we're doing a little more separation, which the staff is very happy to do. They're all glad to be participating in this. I think sometimes people think it's going to cost more money. The people who are picking up our recycling and composting are not charging us any more than we were paying before to have our garbage picked up. It's just a different process. Now, I don't know what their bottom line is or how their business is doing, but I would suspect it's not doing too badly or they wouldn't be doing it. It's pretty straightforward. I don't think there's really any need to change it. I would like to see more, more restaurants participate. I don't know what opens somebody up to finally say, I hear what you're saying. I've always felt that example is, is all you can do. Just be an example and show, okay, this is working for me and it helps. It's a benefit to all of us. And trying to, to show them that it is, not, it is not making their life more complicated, it is in fact making it better. <laughs>